Do we want to back it on the tractor? Oh, that's nice. I like the way his head turns. That's cool. Let's see if I could turn the camera around. Back it like a boss. Oh wow! You see that grass blowing out when he gets when he engages the blades. That's a nice touch. What I was trying to do was figure out how to shut it off. Though. Hey everybody, welcome to Lawn Mowing Simulator. Now this is the demo version. The game actually comes out on Steam August 10th, which is next Tuesday, and they previously had a demo of this game up for a couple weeks. And I didn't get a chance to play it, so they have they have reissued the demo on the Steam page. I do want to give a shout out to my friend Sasha. She told me about this game, this demo. So I want to I do appreciate her giving me that heads up, and we're gonna give it a try and see if we like it. So this is the preliminary career mode. We're gonna set up our company name. Let's see. Do I just type it in here? We're going to call it Medley's Mowing. It may be way too long. And let's see, the company logo. Okay, what kind of options have we got here? That's not horrible. That's a little too flowery for me. Actually, that's kind of cool there. see what this one looks like so we can put it on the front of the shirt edit player player appearance on this screen you can customize your in-game appearance of your players avatar as well as their physical appearance you can change the colors of the company uniform and where your company logo is displayed very cool all right so let's see change the hat okay we've got different colored hats uh, I'm a blue guy Oh, that's too too light. Okay, let's go with that. And how do I get back? Confirm. Logo placement front and back. Front only, back only. Uniform colors. I don't know why I thought this you could spin this guy around, but you can't. Interesting. Um, I'm okay with the black and blue. Primary color black. Actually, let's go primary. That's too bright. We'll go with that blue. And secondary color. Let's go white. Yeah, now that's way too, now the hat is too, too bright. Yeah, we're going to go with your basic blue. Well, I don't know, I'm not sure I like that logo. That's probably the best one. I've seen some other players use that, but honestly it's probably the best one. That looks look more like a tool company. Yeah, that's kind of cool. Let's go with that. Start career mode. Accept. Test drive career mode. Now you have a company of your own. You will need your first vehicle to get cutting. Select a vehicle from the list below and take it for a test drive. All right. All right. So we got this big boy, or we got the normal everyday tractor. Let's start with the normal Stiga. I don't know, the night looks cool. But let's start with this option. As you can see, there's going to be a lot of different mowers. And I actually read on their Steam page today, they're thinking about implementing push mowers as well. So we only have two options in this. Okay, we get our test drive. Cool. Yes. 
So I, I'm actually very excited about trying this game out. I did not get a chance to a couple weeks ago, so I'm excited now. Here you can familiarize yourself with a particular vehicle in condition similar to your real contract. We have to turn the music or the sound down a little bit. Approach the vehicle to get on it. Use WASD to move and mouse to look around. Okay. Let's see if we can turn the sound just a hair. F. Get on vehicle. Vehicle startup. Once you are on your vehicle, you will need to get it started and onto the grass. Each vehicle is slightly different to get going. Follow the steps to get it started at the bottom of the screen. Drive to the grass. With the vehicle started, take a moment to get used to it. Then drive over to the grass and you can start cutting. Hold Z to start the vehicle's engine. Right, I still want to turn that. Turn these down a little bit. Alright, start engine, hold Z. So we gotta get used to the camera a little bit here. Use I and T to change the vehicle's throttle setting. Change the cut height. Use E and C to change the cut height. So to me, this the camera seems a little. Control seems a little weird. That's fine. But the mouse... Gotta get used to this mouse. Alright, change the cut height. Cut height is three and a half. Okay guys, I got the sound turned down a little bit. Um, I, I thought I could change my camera movement this mouse because it's a little wonky to me but we're, just, we're gonna deal with it so you hold down Z to engage the blades cut height career mode when on contracts you will be required to cut the grass to a certain height each contract will have its own height the grass needs to be cut to set your cut height within the range of five centimeters to six centimeters and cut 20% of the grass contract progress while cutting you can track your progress with the bar in the top right progress bar shows you how much of the required amount you have cut. Grass cut at the correct height fills the bar white. Grass that is cut too short fills the bar with red. Okay. Alright, so... Are our blades engaged? Yes. Cut height is 2 and 3 eighths, but it didn't tell us what height to cut it. Alright, so we change the camera angle. Pro view, hold control, reset camera, click. Change cameras V. Alright, so we got a first person. Okay, we got three different camera angles. Alright, let's get to cutting. Warning, you're cutting the wrong height. Cut height is 1 and 5 eighths. Well, it doesn't tell me the height I'm supposed to be cutting at. You're cutting the wrong cut height. Oh, here we go. Cut height range 2 to 2 and 3 eighths. Okay. 2 to 2 and 3 eighths. There we go, that should be right. Alright, we're cutting now. Maybe first person's better. Yeah. Uh oh. Alright, we don't want to damage our mower on our first day.
and this camera's wonky. I'll have to get something figured out with that. I think first person might be the best best way to go in this game. I don't really know how close I I gotta get. To the bushes, to the, to the wall. Getting those, yeah, when I cut those bushes, oh, maybe go way, way back third person. I actually kind of like that better. Pro view career mode by holding control while stationary, you can engage pro view, which highlights areas of grass that have not been cut to the required height. This is useful for when you're trying to find the last bits of grass to cut to complete a contract. Oh, cool. Okay, cool. Control. Oh, nice. Okay, cool. Yeah, I think I like this... This third-person view, like, right here. Uh oh, so I think I missed some right there. Let's look. Come on, buddy. Turn around. Yeah, see so this little strip right there? So that might come into play if we were trying to get 100% of the grass cut. Okay, so my first impressions after getting all the settings fixed, worked out, uh, I like the game. It's, I, yeah, I like it. It's, can be, I think it's going to be one of these games that can be relaxing and kind of like the Power Wash simulator game, it's just kind of relaxing. We just mowing, getting it done for money. You know, you you got a you got a lawn mowing business. Who didn't mow lawns when you're a kid, making some money? Except for now, you're a big kid. Okay, what was that about? Did you see the red? I don't know why it went red on me over there. Go back to first person. So the first person isn't bad either. Uh oh. Totally missed a spot. Well, I missed a whole section. There we go. Now we're back on track. So the only downside to this first person I see is you can't really tell how wide you're mowing. Warning, you're... What did that say? Warning, you're... I missed it. Are you over... Am I overheating the mower, maybe? Let's see if we can get it, get it again. Now I'm playing on. Oh, I did it again. I'm playing keyboard and mouse. You could probably have a lot smoother turning, of course, with the the controller. 
I just play everything with keyboard and mouse. There's a couple of strips right there that I missed. Alright, let's kick back out to third person. So this has a very limited view you can do with the camera angle. But it's not bad. Oh, we went in the red again. What is that saying? Uh oh, totally missed a strip there. And then we hit V one more time to change our, our V one more time. Okay, cool. So let's disengage the blades. That's Z. Do we want to back it on the tractor? Oh, that's nice. I like the way his head turns. That's cool. Let's see if I could turn the camera around. Back it like a boss. Nope. Oh wow! Just <laughs> grass blowing out when he gets when he engaged the blades. That's a nice touch. What I was trying to do was figure out how to shut it off, though. Okay, I don't know how to shut it off. Start engine. Hold Z. How do you shut off the engine? Oh, I bet we have to throttle down. Yeah, you hit I for throttle down. Yeah, and then hit Z again. And then, how do I get off? I don't know how to get off the mower. F, E, nope. Okay. Alright. So, let's quit. And what I wanted to see was, I want to try the other mower. After completing the test drive, you can now purchase the vehicle, or if you would like, you can test drive the other available vehicle. Yes, I want to try the other vehicle. I want to try the Knight. Are you sure you want to purchase the Knight OFS1 for $26.50? This action cannot be undone. Well, I thought I could just test drive it. Yeah, let's buy it. Select a contract. This is the contractor map, contract map, where you can see available contracts to select and start. Now your company is set up and you have a mower. Select the contract button at the bottom of the map to open it for setup. Okay, so we can do the the front garden. Probably the only contract we have, isn't it? Newcomer. So we have a we get RP points for our reputation. That's reputation points. Projected earnings. Okay, that's cool. All right. So I think this is our only option. Once you select a contract, you can see information about its value and requirements. If you wish to accept the contract, you first need to assign an employee and vehicle. Select either the employee or vehicle option to the left next. Okay. Contracts need an employee assigned to them to be a, to be attempted. At the minute, at the minute, the only employee you have is you, but that will change as your company grows. So we can hire employees eventually. Highlight yourself and then confirm the assignment to the contract. That's me. Okay, and then the vehicle. Contracts need a vehicle assigned to them to be attempted. At the minute, you only have one, but that will change as your company grows and makes more money. Highlight your vehicle and then confirm the assignment to the contract. Yes. Okay. There we go. Confirm the contract. Now the contract has both an employee and vehicle assigned. You need to confirm the contract. Once a contract is confirmed with both an employee and vehicle, you can start it. Confirm contract. Okay, so our cutting height needs to be two and two and two and three eighths. 
ground check time limit. I don't know what this is. Oh, maybe that's to uh, where our pro view, maybe. Recommended cut time, 26 minutes. Recommended deck width, 39 and 3 eighths. This tells us how much the current grass is, the, the rain, so that's cool. All right, 2 and 2 3 eighths. We need to remember that. Start your contract. Are you set? As you set up and confirm contracts, their pin on the map will turn yellow, and the contract that you are assigned to will have a star displayed. With the first contract confirmed, you can start it and head to the location to begin cutting. There we go. Uh, who knows how how big this map is going to be? Looks like we got lots of options. All right, let's go check. I like the little spinning blade down there in the right hand side, the loading screen. Keep an engine on vehicles. I think that said keep an eye on your vehicle's engine load. That's probably why it was turning red. This mower may be a little big for this yard. So it looks like we get a nice cut scene of the of what we're dealing with here, the situation we're dealing with here, the yard we're dealing with here. Oh, and I confirm I'm ready. <laughs> Ground check phase. At the start of each contract, you have a small period of time to find and remove any objects on the grass area that could either be damaged or damage your vehicle. You can choose to skip the ground check and have the objects automatically removed by interacting with your mower. But this will mean you don't earn money or RP. Ground check. Zero of three objects collected. Okay. So. Okay. So we have to find three objects that might hurt our mower. I think that's what that means. So that's kind of cool. Maybe. Oh, there's a gnome. That's probably one. Okay, it even it highlights it for us. Okay, what is it? Tennis ball. Pick up object. There we go. I bet this little gnome is one. Yes. Okay, it probably doesn't always... It's probably not going to be that easy, always. Whoa, look at that big beam over there where our mower's at. Alright, we need one more. Looks like we need one more object that could mess up our mower. Oh, there it is. What was that? Baseball. Baseball. Alright, return to vehicle. Ground check complete. Now it's got a little... Got a big beam and a yellow beam in case we ever lose our lawnmower. So the graphics look nice. I like it. I like it. Oh, let's check out this car. Slick looking little sports car. And a newer sports car in the garage. Garage is a little ratty looking though. We got an old bike hanging here. But we really need to do something with these bricks here. And this old cement. Copper wire. That's a lot of money there. You can take that and sell it. Alright, let's get going. I'm being silly now. Look at that glowing mower. Alright, get on the vehicle. F. Contract cutting. With the ground check complete, it's time to start cutting some grass. Start up your vehicle and drive over to the lawn to begin. Alright, so we hold down Z. Increase the throttle with T. Guess we gotta go this way. Change cut high E and C. Okay, so this this camera, I will have to get it figured out because it really bugs me. It seems really, really odd to me. But I'll get that figured out. Your performance during cutting will affect how much money, RP, reputation points you earn from the contract. You need to find the balance between speed and careful driving, avoiding damaging the flowers or lawn while cutting quickly and earn a time bonus. Okay. So the cut height was supposed to be 
was it two and we can hit escape two to two and three eighths okay we're we are two and three quarters I'm gonna put it two and three eighths Q to lower the deck and C start it up nice Don't damage the flowers. Okay, you're getting a little close there, buddy. Wow, this thing turns on a dime. Very nice. Okay, watch the flowers. Probably, whoa, it, 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 it. Oh, I brushed the flower. Careful. Easy. Let's try a different. Let's try a first person here. Okay, okay. Let's go one back. I'm taking it slow this first run around the flowers. Do not want to cut these people's flowers. Do I have to get that? Let's try control. Oh, I do have to cut it. Okay. I was thinking about the grass right there underneath the gate. Uh oh! Hit the little uh, little gate. Oh no! That's not good. That is damaging on our mower. All right, I don't like that camera angle at all. Seems really weird. I'm not sure if I like this mower better than the other one. Okay, so you got that initial pass, so we should be able to just go a little faster now. Got one little strip there I missed as well. Alright, so we're almost five minutes in, and it's it told us that we should be able to cut this in 26 minutes. I keep missing some strips all right getting pretty good oh got my we got a little hot so this game could easily be compared to farming simulator instead of mowing fields or mowing grass but I like the I like the career aspect of it that's cool missed a little bit there Okay, is this the gate where we came in on? This camera will drive me a little nuts. I'll have to get used to that. I know I've said that a hundred times already. All right, let's disengage the blade. Raise the deck is Q. Okay. So we were halfway done in seven minutes, almost halfway done in seven minutes. So that's not bad. Uh oh. All right, my backing skills. I'm not backing this one like a boss. Okay, that's better. Attention, exit contract. Are you sure you want to exit the contract? Doing so will lead to a loss of earnings. Yes. For now, I want to exit the contract. We didn't earn any money on there. In wet weather, it's much easier to... I couldn't read that. Okay, guys. Well, let me know what you think in the comments section. 
I like this game. I, if it's reasonably priced, this is one that I'll be buying. And I, I think I'll, I'll get some enjoyment out of it. And if you guys like it, make sure to hit that like button. And tell me in the comments if you want to see more. And if you're new to the channel, make sure to hit that subscribe button. I do appreciate each and every one of you that subscribes. And I thank you for watching today. Come back and see me for full episodes of Lawn Mower Simulator. Thanks for watching. Bye for now.